I just want to welcome you all to the, um, I guess this is going to be the Christmas special because it's Christmas time and it's a thing. It's elves and Cheetos as requested by a man named Teddy. Now, I went with the crunchy Cheetos. I like those ones. I only got a little bag because I didn't, you know, they're not, they're not that great for you. They're kind of, kind of honestly not, not good for, for anything. Um, I think they catch on, I think you can use them as, as torches. I think you can set them on fire and use them like a candle. Um, so maybe they're good for that. I'm not positive on that. If someone would comment in the comment section and let me know, um, that would be, that'd be super helpful. So what about the elf set? Well, this one here is the magic rescue from Goblin Village. It's 637 pieces and that's way too many pieces to get covered with Cheetos dust. So I'm going to be using... This one, it's uh, Sierra's Adventurous Air Glider. Now, I've already reviewed this one, but you may see that it was $3.99. <laughs> it's because my camera was going out of business, and actually, it was like um, an extra 40% off or something. Uh, kids go free to Legoland. It expires the 31st of 2017th, 12th month. That's fun. What about the, uh, the other stuff? The Denmark, Hungary, Mexico, and China. What's, hey boy. what's that, Ben Murphy? This is a holiday letdown. Yeah, sometimes the holidays are a letdown, and I'm not the one that's ruining Christmas. I think people who want to watch Cheetos and Lego builds are. So I guess the most important thing is we'll have to open up the Cheetos. And I guess the only fair way is to start with a Cheeto. And there's already Cheeto dust on my hands now. And we'll dump these parts out. Now, I think I'm going to remove MFE because I don't want him to get covered in Cheeto dust. Number two Cheeto. I've actually reviewed this one once. So I don't really need to do it again, but I will. Uh, build the mini doll. There's uh, nine instructions on the front and a bunch of ads for season two elves on the back. Not uh, not too bad. So we'll just reach my hand in here. This is basically going to be an ASMR video, I'm sure, by the end of it. So, the figure here, before I get that hand too covered in Cheeto dust. Oh, their hair is crooked, but there's actually a video that you can watch of me reviewing this set, if you don't want to see it done with Cheetos. We'll set her up there, because I don't want her actually to be all covered in Cheeto dust. We're going to say Cheeto dust a lot this video, I'm sure. One more camera movement before before I get uh, actually building. So I've got 24 pieces here. Not a great price per part ratio, but let's just go ahead and get one of these on the other hand. It isn't any helping it, I don't think, at this point. The double clip thing goes in the back. Mm. And Cheeto dust. Oh, that white piece, and it's super obvious to me. I don't know if you can see it or not. But it's actually really difficult to grab these things. But they're all slippery now from the Cheeto grease. Okay, um, this round piece. Oh, 
Now, I know some of you are going to be really upset by this video. Why didn't I choose the puffy, the puffy kind of, um, the puffy Cheetos? And the short answer is I really don't enjoy puffy Cheetos. I think that they're, um, a lot of air. And I feel like they might be greasier. And I probably could have went with um, baked Cheetos if I hadn't chosen a small bag. I think they're only available in like big bags around me. Or they're available with um, like school packs with like dozens of small bags. <laughs> okay, so this is going to go here, if I can pick it up, oh my gosh. Now I've used the recording pen of besting today because I feel like it's appropriate to use it around food related. Oh no, there's Cheeto dust all up in that lamp post holder. Oh, that's right, there's these little leak pieces. I like those pieces a lot. I think they look really good on a lot of things to add just a little bit of texture and color. So I think the Cheeto dust has gotten inside some of the Lego pieces, and this one particularly, this wing, fell off really easy. I think it might be something to do with that. Now, if I recall correctly, yes. This piece goes on here, this golden binoculars. Oh, wow, it's just so hard to do this. It's actually not something I was expecting to have issues with. I figured there'd just be Cheetos everywhere. One of the cookies goes up there. And then these little feather pieces go in the back. And that's the build. Now, bump the camera. Hmm. Oh, for you come out because. Nah, that's not so bad. My fingers were covered in Cheeto dust and I didn't want to touch the camera. So. Um, I think that's the review. The thing's got swooshability. I wouldn't put it between anything, if you know what I mean, um, at this point. But this is this is a real man's theme. Um, patrician's cho choice. Um, pleblians, pleb plebs don't don't even come near this. This is this is for real men. Um, ladies go moist when they when they build. Elves set. So there's a lot of lot of um, playability with this to be able to, to position those wings however you like. And of course you got a you got a map here. Oop. Map here. Let me see if I can get that to focus in there. Come on. I forget to review the map. So it's not focusing great. But I'm, I'm gonna actually attempt to touch the camera. Force the focus. Oh, that's that's not so bad. Yep, just um, just a good old fashioned printed two by two tile, just just like what I remember as a kid. So that's that's ideal. Um, the figure we didn't look at, she's got that that um. Well, I guess we can look at the figure. I already own one of them. She's got that spring green mint colored hair and the purple streak there. Very nice. She can sit, of course, and actually she can sit inside the air flyer thing. And if I can pick up the map again, just put it in her hand. Yep, and that's that's the set, guys. So, um, MFE's not on screen. Oh man! Well, click on the bag of Cheetos for a video that you might enjoy. Um, click on the elves for the original review of the elf flyer. 
Um, my guy's back there too, but uh, somewhere else there'll be a subscription link so you can watch more holiday specials with your favorite professional Lego channel. Ooh. I hate you guys.